English K1 under 60, under 60 kilogram K1 rules. Title is bound sponsored by Nicola the top of all, Matilda Personal Trainer. Sponsored by Nicola Matilda Personal Trainer. This bout is over five two rounds. Firstly, boxing out in the blue corner from Infliction, James Lusco. Boxing out in the red corner from the Lincoln Vice Factory, Craig. He tips the other 59 kilograms. He brings to the ring a 14 by record with 10 wins. From Lincoln by Factory, Craig. Boom, boom, three. So we're ready to go. English title at stake. And Green comes out strongly with those knees. Nice turning from Lascombe, but Green forging forward, trying to keep him off balance and driving those knees in every opportunity. Very fast-paced start for the opening round. He's going to be warned now because it's got to be strike. You've got to catch, release. You can't hold him and pull him on. It's not Muay Thai rules, it's K1 rules. He touched gloves. Luscombe looking to remain calm as Green really sets the pace here in the opening round. Big high round kick then the left and right. Nice movement by Green now. And you can see fires up on the shots and then moves up. But he's getting those knees in quickly and consistently. They touch gloves sportingly. Low kick from Luscombe as he comes in. Chops away that lead leg again, so the reply and then the front push kick from Green. Nice little right uppercut from Luscombe. Brings the knee in, they've got a release straight afterwards. Green stepping back and then throws the jab. It's that preemptive counter as I was on the back. Spins with the kick, then drives the knee in once more. Set a fast pace, Luscombe looking to respond, Green calling him on. Nice combination work from both young men. Steps away from that right hand, Green. Checks the kick. Luscombe goes high with the round kick. Green turns, throws the knee, pushes him away. Little uppercut from Luscombe. Comes back with the left hand, Green. Chopping low, Luscombe takes the knee with the tight guard though. Comes forward for the front, front push kick, perfectly timed takedown. Luscombe acknowledges it right at the bell and that can be vital in this opening round in favour for me and possibly the judges after that for Craig Green with the movement and the amount of shots thrown as well. Round two of five, and Green comes out strong again. Luscombe looking to match him, doubling up those low kicks. The knee in reply from Green, left and right. Luscombe coming forward more strongly here in the second leg, chopping with that lead round kick. To that lead leg of Green. Checks the kick this time, but then Luscombe comes over the top. More short start here in the second from Luscombe. Green chopping away at his legs as he comes in, but they're targeting that lead leg of Green again. Nice work to the body with the shots there, the punches from Green. But Luscombe targets that leg low again, tucks up tight for the counters and really chopping at that front leg. Inside and out. 
chops again targeting the legs of Craig Green that will slow him down across these rounds he's not checking them he's taking them and already here in the second with still three to go Green will feel this pace Luscombe I thought lost the first but for me he's really driving forward here in the second tucking up tight with those punches so that he can stay there with him and then throw either that knee or that chopping low kick Green comes in with the punches but again Luscombe there's the balance going and this is what will happen over the five rounds as he stays in front of Green tucks up for the punches but chops at that lead leg consistently and that will take the mobility and the sting out of Green as he does so again big second round here for me for Luscombe in the blue which will bring this even after two but how much will it take out of Green those leg kicks So round three of five and Green, how much has that taken out of him with the legs and again, it's a good tactic from Luscombe, he sits there tight and he just chops at those legs. So despite the work rate from Green, as you can see, Luscombe tucks up here and he doesn't take as much cleanly and it gives him the, the room to really crash in either to the body or those legs. That's better from Green, he needs to reply like that, he needs to check and reply like that but Luscombe now beginning to work the body as well here in round three left to the body right to the leg jumping knee from Green really superb third round so, so far then the knee and the, the right leg from Luscombe excellent bout across these three rounds so far Green I thought had a really strong opener Luscombe came back superbly in the second with his tactics and timing beautifully for there from Green. It's back and forward now here in the third with two to go. It's a superb bout for the English title. Excellent cardio as well from both men. That lead leg of Green's taken a pepper in, but he's still light on his feet. He's still mobile. For me, Luscombe looking to push forward the whole time and stay in the pocket with Green. And you can see that tight guard, so it means he can crash into these legs. And then he brings the right over the top, then the corkscrew. Chopping at that lead leg again, especially when that foot is flat on the floor, taking the weight, weight-bearing leg when you kick, as you do again there. Luscombe staying in the pocket, but Green coming back with the boxing, and then the push kick to the face. What a third round this is turning out to be. What a beautiful round. Back and forward, back and forward. Superb midway point to this pack with two rounds still to go. Four of five, and they continue like they did with three. What an absolute war this has been. What a delight for an English title bout. The stamina, the commitment, and the technique of these two young men. Superb on an excellent promotion here tonight. The top billings, the main events living up to it. We had a wonderful world title fight, and now this British title fight. What a bout. And again, Luscombe looking to stay there. And then suddenly Green spins with a side kick that he had to block to the face. Luscombe again chops at that leg. The pace from these two men here in the fourth. Will something give before the fifth? Because the pace since round one has been absolutely frantic. Worthy of a title fight, and just when I thought maybe Green had taken one kick too many to the legs, he'll either spin with a kick or throw a fantastic combination. Luscombe, though, continues to pull forward. Nice movement from Green. 
Just that little turn to give him the room. Peppering with the shots there, they're all on the gloves. And that's what Luscombe's doing, he's taking these on the gloves to get in close. But nice high round kick from Green. Luscombe chops low again. Green goes to respond with the same kick. Those rear leg roundhouses to the lead leg, punishing from both men. Luscombe backing Green up, the knee from Green. The low kicks from both men. Luscombe stays there, as you see that tight guard, throws that short combination, peppers the leg. Looks to create the space, that was the best knee of the back, then the right hand over the top from Luscombe. Beautifully timed. Inside leg kick, it's close, it's close, but for me, Luscombe in the blue took that fourth. But it's been a cracking bout and superb work from both men. Lovely to watch this bout. Luscombe pushes forward again, Green waiting to counter him, Luscombe with the right hand over the top, Green with that left hand has boxing combination coming through now, really looking to open Luscombe up, Luscombe retains the tight guard, doubles up the low leg kick, looks for the uppercut himself, that third low leg kick, Green forced to turn, chops away again, doubles up the right hand, looks for the left knee and the right hand once more, tucks up tightly and the difference between the two men is, is the way that Luscombe uses that defence to turn it into offence is very tight it's like a crab he tucks up tight and then when he's close unleashes the right hand or those low leg kicks gets into range chops with that right leg again to the lead leg green looking for the boxing combinations but Luscombe backing him up that left knee as well the knees of Luscombe comes forward once more pushes him back the teep from Green to keep that range. Left knee, Luscombe. Right hand over the top. Green looks for his own chopping low kick. Luscombe responds immediately. Looks for that left knee. Right hook from Green. What an encounter this has been for the English title. Luscombe comes in once more with the knee. Teep doesn't quite carry the quality it did in the previous round from Green, but you can expect that these five rounds have been this pace the whole time. And Luscombe chops at that lead leg, chops again. Chops once more as Green comes forward. Listen to the crowd here. What a bout, what a final round as they go for it. Straight out of the Rocky movies, this one. Luscombe standing and trading with Green. Oh... Beautiful stuff from both men. Right round kick from Green, high and hard. But Luscombe has pushed forward the whole time. It is K1. You look for the aggressor. The cardio, the work rate, the technique of both men. The majority decision in favour of your winner in the blue corner.